The documentation for KiCad 8 has been updated and improved, and many new features and changes are now already documented, making it much easier for long-time users and new users to navigate and explore the software. And in my experience, I've been, I've been using KiCad since version 4. Uh, documentation has, has always been an afterthought, it seemed to me, and it was always lagging way be, behind what was actually happening with the KiCad software itself. So when a new feature would come out, I personally had to spend a lot of time essentially reverse engineering and, and trying this and that and the other to try and see how that new feature worked. Now I've been looking at the new documentation that has been released alongside KiCad 8 and it actually looks pretty good and pretty well up to date. So I'm very happy to see that it's going to make my work and I'm sure your work as well much easier. So there's information about the KiCad workflow, the individual KiCad components, user interface, projects, files, and that's just part of the introduction. You can drill into the individual KiCad apps. So here is uh, information about the project files and the main KiCad window. Lots of information. I'm really impressed by how much good content has been produced here. There's information about the schematic editor, the PCB editor, and so on. I'll be spending a lot of time drilling through this documentation as I'm looking at what's new and also all the features that uh, existed in previous versions that hadn't been documented well enough